now. This is no time to engage in the luxury of cooling off or to take the tranquilizing drug of gradualism. To the citizens of the United States and the United States government, we are anonymous. It has come to our attention that after centuries of enslavement, suppression, and misinformation, we are here to inform you that we have entered a new era of hope, unity, and love. On April 14, 2014, we are launching, declaring, and engaging Operation Unity. We have been forced to take action into our own hands because there is a spiritual internal war that has arisen with the intentions to cause the destruction of a higher consciousness. We will not allow this to continue. We will, as an army of love, continue spreading love and peace while guiding the American people to the truth. Citizens of America, it is time to wake up. World War III has already begun. The United States government has yet to officially declare it, and yet within due time it will become too obvious that the U.S. is fully engaged. Soon they will be forced to declare World War III officially to the citizens of America. The war has originated from China as a silent force behind communication to North Korea and Russia, creating different interpretations which in turn create conflict. China has a plan to be the number one source of power, the nation's dependency will be cut off and will create much suffering for those not covered as the families of those who are in power. California is being filled with radioactive energy. The air is getting dense, crops will not grow, people will become sick. This is not being talked about. The United States government has misinformed your people. The Malaysian plane has not been found. It is still missing. China is looking for answers. Those who have answers have been killed or captured by the Malaysian government. False news is used as a distraction tactic to gear people away from the war with Russia and the Ukraine. Keeping people entertained with a missing plane story allows the government to continue carrying out their acts of war. Without public panic, keeping you misinformed. You must store water in your homes and businesses. It is imperative that you store water. What once made the United States the number one nation in the world was the belief in God, freedom and prosperity. We must revert back to the original morals that this country was founded on. Liberty and justice, faith and courage that the unseen is working with us. Patriotism and culture will grow once again. Every culture is to be honored. We will succeed in our mission. Operation Uni will be established in four phases. We will disclose phase one to you now. The first phase will be launching the Army of Love, which consists of gathering our troops to strengthen the core, furthermore, growing and bringing awareness to the cause. The inside job is knowing that the core of the Army of Love has come together. Every day a new soldier will arise here. Each nation is to create a base. Each base will hold a battalion, a body of troops ready to engage in acts of love. Each battalion has platoons, each platoon serving a different purpose. We are enlisting for the Army of Love. Troops are to be gathered. Will you be among them? For a mission, contact us at uni at armyoflove.com. Your commanders will be disclosed in due time. We are anonymous. We are legion. We are everywhere. We are everyone. Expect us.